I believe in America. I believe we are the best. I have spent my life working hard, trying to do the right thing. I just hope when you vote, you remember that. I'd like to remind you what this contest is about. It is about excellence in butter. God bless America. Welcome to the Steak Mastery in Butter Competition. You're the Elvis of butter. You're a legend. Back in 94, Bob reveals Schindler's List. It just made me cry. And we're not even Jewish. I really think Bob and I could parlay this fame we have from butter into politics. I mean, don't be surprised if you see us in the governor's mansion or the White House. This will be your bedroom. You know how you guys asked if I needed anything? Mm hmm You don't have butter. I'll get you some. OK, I only need, like, 200 pounds. Tokyo Rose, I think I love you. My real name's Brooke. Oh my god. What the? You came in between me and my man. Bob is my husband. I plan on proudly bearing his children. So? I get pregnant like once a month. When they see what I have planned for them, these so-called judges, their jaws are gonna hit the floor. Oh my god. <laughs> have you had your boobs done? Have you worked with butter before? I've worked with it all. What's the worst thing that can happen if you enter this contest? There could be a python inside. What if this place is full of good-looking British vampires? Or racist ninjas. <laughs> I present to you the Scarlet Letter. For those of you who don't know, it's a movie starring Demi Moore. Put it on bread. It's amazing, isn't it? I think that might be Harriet Tubman. And she obviously decided to play the race card. You can do this. You can take down Laura Pickler. You kick her pasty white ass. I don't think I want you hanging out with strippers, okay? But I, it's the greatest gift in life. But all you need is a knife. You people are ridiculous. It's butter. You put it on toast. Oh, oh, and newsflash. It's bad for you. Yeah. <gasps> I said it out loud. What? Really? The butter police? Wow.